my lovelies welcome to my channel here we are doing another spell for you guys uh, this is highly recommended for those of you guys that want to start off uh, the new year uh, cleansing and removing any negative energy as well as being able to embrace or being able to uh, bring towards you these are this spell specifically for those that are looking for partnerships relationship or romance in general um, this is to attract as well as to wake up uh, your kundalini now oftentimes you know throughout throughout life sometimes we may experience like there is a bit of lack of movement in regards to our love and in regards to romance uh, and sometimes we have to um, we have to wake that vibration now uh, this is specifically for those of you guys that have been single for quite a while and like I said there's been a bit of lack of movement in regards to romance um, you know we have this uh, this saying uh, when you have a dry spell you know uh, where there's really not no momentum no movement in regards to love and romance uh, it's usually because your sexual energy is uh, it's it's you know it's uh, what's the word I'm looking for um, it's not activated uh, this could be from past experiences relationships you've had in the past uh, this could be links that you're still caring from other people etc uh, there's many reasons why our sexual energy sometimes uh, can be literally, you know, asleep. It's not awoken. Uh, so you have to take the steps that is necessary in order to awaken, like I said, your kundalini, your sexual energy, and to be able to vibrate uh, a bit stronger, to be able to attract. So this serves as a magnetic um, pull uh, for those of you guys that are trying to attract or bring towards you love. You will notice that when you do this um, in the coming days, you will start to notice more people wanting to make conversation with you or you catch someone eyeballing you. <laughs> um, this is a very strong uh, sexual spell that is going to help you, like I said, wake up that animalistic uh, in you, the sexual energy. Uh, which, of course, sexual energy is very important to bring towards us uh, certain targets or certain, um, depending on what it is that you're trying to bring towards you, right? So anyways, this is for love. Now, all you really need is any type, as you can see here, any type of champagne bottle. Doesn't matter what it is. It could be the cheap kind. It could be the expensive kind. It doesn't matter. Whatever works for you, you can use that. Now you're also going to be needing some sugar, a little container where you can put the sugar. Um, what we're going to do is you can use uh, the sugar and water, or you can add some of the uh, some of the body wash if you use any type of body wash, any type of um, soap that is liquid. Uh, now. The advice here is, I find this to be very, very strong, especially for clients and, uh, you know, family members that are trying to bring in love towards them when I do this. Now, what you can do is, you can get water, any type of water, as you can see here. Um, put some rose petals and a stick of cinnamon, as you can see here. Now, this has been charging for a good five days. You can do this and leave it overnight. The full moon is quickly approaching us. You can do this and charge this water on the full night. Uh, sorry, on the full moon night. Or you can charge it um, from now all the way to the full moon. And you can actually do the ritualized bath um, on the full moon so that it could be that much more stronger it can be amplified keep in mind we're getting the full moon in cancer which is all to do with emotions so again this is really going to be empowering type of spell to do like i said you can do this from now all the way to the beginning of 2021 now can you do this um, after new year's absolutely you can do the spell whenever you feel that you're having a dry spell what we call 
uh, which is not seeing a lot of movement in regards to love or your romance, uh, then this will definitely shake up your energy, remove any blockages that you may be currently experiencing uh, in any area of your body. So again, if you want to empower this, put some rose petals on water with a cinnamon stick and leave it there for a good 24 hours before using it. Now you can, of course, like I said, from now all the way to the full moon, you can leave it charging. And once you start to see the water kind of turn like a gold color, then you know that the essence of the rose is already penetrated the water and it. That's exactly what we want. This is definitely going to empower, strengthen the spell, uh, make it that much more effective, okay? All right, so let's get into, like I said, the ingredients, sugar, champagne bottle, um, a, a little container where you can do the mixture of the sugar and the water and any type of liquid soap. It could be, um, a, it could be any type of uh, liquid soap. Uh, if you have a preference or you have a tendency of using body wash or anything like that, you would uh, integrate that, okay? So it's very simple. Like I said, you can do this a few days before doing this. Now, the champagne is used um, in our practice for many different things. It is uh, It could be used to remove when we run uh, ritualized baths. Um, it purifies our energy. It purifies our aura. Uh, it cleanses, but it also wakens, like I said, uh, the sexual energy. Now, depending on what type of spell you're doing, it has many uses when we use champagne in our body. So... For this specific spell, it's going to be, like I said, to awaken your sexual energy, your animalistic side, uh, to be able to attract and pull towards you much more uh, suitors, uh, more partners or people that aren't looking for love the way you are, okay? So, very simple, like I said, you have this prepared, uh, a container where you can put uh, what you're going to be using now. Of course, you can use a bigger container than this. This is the one I found handy right now. Um, I'm actually using this for a client. So um, I will be preparing this for him. And you know, and you, you could do this if you're a male or female. It doesn't matter. Um, so what we're going to do is you're going to do the mixture of... You're going to get uh, the sugar... And what we use the sugar for is we're going to use it as a body scrub. Now, when we're putting this on our body, <clears throat> make sure to cleanse yourself or shower yourself the way you would regularly do. Once you're done with that, then this is going to, this is going to be the last step. Um, so again, like I said, we're going to use it as a body scrub. And what you're doing is you're going to pass the sugar uh, all over your body in a circular motion, all over your body. Uh, now, in a circular motion going clockwise, what you're doing is, again, you're awakening your sexual energy. You're awakening uh, and raising your vibration. So you would do it in a circular motion all over your body. Uh, you can say any type of prayer. Um, ideally, make sure to uh, state that you are awakening uh, your kundalini, that you are awakening your sexual energy to vibrate to its highest potential uh, when scrubbing uh, the sugar, when scrubbing this all over your body. Now, like I said, uh, you would add some of the uh, soap, any type of liquid soap, uh, if you have a preference, um, any type of um, you know, body shower thingy, you can use that. You would add some of that on here as well as add some of this water. So give me one second. Let me pour some in here. Okay. All right. So it's going to look something like this. Uh, and like I said, you're just going to really charge it when you are working with this uh, you can uh, do an incantation on it over it uh, placing your hands over this um, as an example 
in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, I bless and consecrate, um, I bless and consecrate the sugar so that it may be able to attract and pull towards me. Love, uh, you can state anything you're looking for commitment. That's what you're going to be uh, including in your prayer. You're wanting a relationship, a partnership, or you just want to date. Um, you know, you can say, I, you know, I charge this sugar and this uh, water, this blessed water. Uh, to be able to attract and bring to me more suitors um, so that I can be able to experience love or romance, uh, etc. Uh, once that is done, like I said, you're going to shower the way you regularly do. Once you're done with that, that's when you're going to get uh, the sugar and the water. Uh, you're going to, you know, pass it all over your body, uh, anoint it all over your body, I should say, in a circular motion. Uh, calling love in so you're gonna say uh, something along the lines of I am love I open my heart I open my mind my body and my spirit to receive love I have so much love to give and I am open now to receive so much love uh, thank the spirits I thank the spirits of love of romance uh, of beauty uh, allow me to shine through uh, my soul energy allow me to shine through uh, my true authentic self to be able to pull towards me uh, those that are looking for or that are wanting or that are ready uh, to commit as an example um, or to date uh, to experience or to be able to experience happiness joy uh, prosperity in every single aspect of my life while you're anointing this all over your body once you're done with that uh, what you're going to do now is you're going to uh, let the water rinse that all over your body or away from your body, I should say. Once you're done with that, the champagne is going to be the last step. And what you do is you literally open the champagne bottle um, and you're going to pour this all over your body. So ideally, I would pour this over my head and all over my body. Again, saying out loud, I am open to love. I am open to give and receive love. Uh, I thank the universe. I thank the spirits of love, of romance, of beauty to allow me to vibrate to the highest of my frequencies. I am ready now to receive love. Uh, once that is done and once you have poured the, all the bottle all over yourself, uh, then what you're going to do is you're going to make sure to air dry you cannot dry yourself with a towel or anything like that. You have to air dry. Uh, make sure not to put any type of lotion or perfume after this is done, uh, at least till the next day. Uh, and like I said, you will start to notice more people looking at you, trying to make conversation, uh, being very receptive, you know, just random people making conversation with you because you're going to become much more approachable. So, those of you guys that try this out, I highly recommend you uh, to come back and in the comment section, let us know what your experience was. Let us know uh, what differences you noticed in your life. I wish you guys the very best. Happy holidays. I hope that this new year brings to you all the love, abundance, prosperity, success, health that you deserve. I send you guys all my love and we will see each other soon. Bye.